know you've talked a lot about this team playing some really good basketball, but guys didn't get up to the best start that you wanted, but finished strong. Just what does it continue to say about the direction that you guys are heading in over these last five games? You know, that's that's a big key. Uh, our starts uh, to the court, quarters, uh, the first quarter, um, as well as the second quarter. Uh, offensively, we were able to, you know, come down and score, uh, but defensively, uh, they were lighting us up. Uh, in that first half and uh, shooting 70% for most of that uh, that half. Uh, you know, the challenge to our guys was uh, to D up, you know, uh, tighten up the defense, uh, try to hold them under 25 uh, in the third and fourth. Uh, the third, they scored 30, but the quarter that uh, really matters, uh, the fourth, uh, we held them to 23. The zone was really good for us tonight. and. Uh, now our guys have a rhythm. I thought they did a good job of executing and attacking uh, their defense. Uh, so we were scoring. We just needed to tighten up uh, defensively. And as, as far as Trey and DeJounte, we've seen some really good things out of them over these last <clears throat> this five game stretch. I mean, before this, was there like conversations that were had between the two of them just to kind of get them on the same page of what you guys were trying to accomplish? No, uh, nothing really has changed other than, um, you know, the challenge. and understanding where we are or where we were uh, five games ago. Uh, we needed to make a run, uh, start winning some ball games uh, the second half of the season, and uh, we all needed to tighten up our game. Uh, you know, what they're doing uh, now, really attacking, and they're playing in a really good rhythm. Uh, I think Trey is really doing a nice job of initiating the offense, uh, but DJ has been on fire the last few games, mm -hmm. and uh, our guys are, are milking that. Uh, but it was, you know, a number of our guys played well tonight. You know, uh, John shot the ball well. Uh, they're playing, they're playing connected basketball, uh, playing the game the right way, and uh, you know, this is the result of that. What was the difference defensively in that fourth quarter, holding them to twenty-three points? The zone. I thought the zone uh, slowed them down. Uh, made them use some clock. Uh, they couldn't find uh, the matchups. And, uh, you know, they were really doing a good job of attacking uh, man coverage and getting downhill. Uh, but the zone became a stop sign, I thought, for them. And uh, they started moving the ball around the perimeter. They missed a couple shots. We got a little uh, momentum. And uh, I thought that was the difference in the, in, in the game. The word that I've been hearing a lot from a lot of the guys over these last five games is consistency, just yeah. playing that consistent basketball. Have you seen that too, just from every single player on this team doing what they need to do? Yeah, you know, that's what we talked about, you know, creating an identity. Uh, we got to have some consistency in what we do out there on the floor. Uh, and we, we've been able to do that the last five games. Uh, get off to good starts. Uh, offensively, we got really good ball movement. Our defense uh, has been really good. Uh, the last five games tonight was one of those nights where uh, New York came in on fire, uh, and uh, but we were able to, uh, you know, gather ourselves and win that fourth quarter, which was the difference uh, in the game tonight. Coach Johnson from Real Talk Sports, uh, you talked about how well the Knicks shot earlier. At one point, they were shooting eighty percent from the floor. How critical was it for you guys to keep in the shot position at the half? The second thing is, what has been the change in the team? You had six guys in double figures today getting the ball around to more players? Yeah, well, we, we have good ball movement, and we're getting the ball to the open man, and uh, those guys, they're playing connected basketball. You know, we talked about, uh, we talked about, you know, our three C's, calm, clear, and connected, and that's what you're seeing uh, from, from our guys. Uh, defensively, they're connected on their coverages. Uh, offensively, they're connected with the ball movement. Uh, you know, I, the, I think the, uh, the tempo, we're doing a better job of being more patient and ex executing our offense as opposed to coming down and uh, you know settling, taking quick um, you know shots uh, from the perimeter. We we have been uh, doing a better job of attacking the paint uh, when the defense is collapsing. We're moving the ball and getting the guy, uh, getting the open man out uh, the basketball. But really, just playing connected basketball on both ends of the floor. How fun is it to be home for a couple games right now, too, and be on a five-game win streak? Yeah, well, it's great to be home, uh, but we have to win at home. 
and you know that was again the challenge uh, to our guys. Uh, you know we, tw we were 12 and nine uh, here at home, and 11 and 13 on the road. Uh, we can do better than that. We need to do better than that and start winning uh, these home games. And uh, you know tonight uh, we knew it was going to be a tough match up against New York. It was going to be a physical game, and our guys responded to that and uh, was able to get this done. Any last questions, Coach? Thanks, Coach.